Mexico Memorial Airport. Automated weather observation. One, niner, five, three. Mexico Dynamics, Bird 1750, Super Duty is going to be back taxi in 418 Mexico. off of the 750 Super Duty and I have a, a special guest, she's been here for a couple days just learning some things and uh, her and her dad are going to be building a 750 Super Duty and uh, you want to say hi to everybody? Hello! Hi, what's your name now? I'm Rowan. Rowan, yes, and you're from where? Wisconsin. Wisconsin, yes, so she thought she'd come down to Mexico, she thought Mexico, Mexico, and uh, thought it was going to be a little warmer, but uh, we started off this morning at about zero degrees. And uh, well, let's do a short takeoff. We've got the stick back power, glad power, add a little bit of flaps, which we've already done, and the nose comes off instantly. Nose comes up. The sun is bright today. Well, excellent performance today on a nice cool day. Actually, cool cold day. Yeah. Well, you and your dad, you're going to be building the 750 Super Duty, and uh, so you've been down here just learning some basic skills, uh, doing a little bit of shop work, learning all the different tricks of the trade. What do you think so far? It's pretty fun. I mean, we've only been down here since yesterday, but right. we've done a lot. And you've been working on the computer a little bit, learning the CAD drawings and everything, which is a Super Duty, which um, you're using a lot of SolidWorks, and uh, you and you're learning that because you want to maybe do computer work later in life too? What, what grade are you in? I'm in 8th grade. 8th grade, alright. That, that is so neat that uh, being in 8th grade building an airplane, I mean it's very, that's, that's very neat. A lot of your friends should be jealous. Yeah, it, it makes for some interesting conversation. Oh yeah, what are you doing? I'm building an airplane. What? Yeah, exactly. 
So, have you started any flying lessons or anything yet? Um, no, at our airport there's not really like... Now looky there, looky there, we got a bald eagle right here. Looky there, right there. I see him. Yep. Let's see if we can catch him in the, in the video. Put him in the video. Yeah, he was, uh, he just popped right in. I bet he's over there feeding at the lake. You never notice how fast they are. Oh, they are. They They're super it. fast. Uh, we're going to keep our distance, but uh, I'd just like to see him again. It's hard to find them again. Now the Super Duty is a, it's a nice airplane. You and your dad, and even your sister, you're uh, you know you're over six foot tall, uh, so you got a lot of headroom, a lot of visibility. Yeah. When we were when we were picking which one we were going to build, like uh -huh. that was one of the main components that we needed. Right. This by far was one of the best space wise. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, it there he is. Uh, down. Below us or above us? Below us. Oh, uh, yeah, I see. There we go. That's the nice thing about this aircraft. You've got great visibility. You can turn on a dime. There he is below us. Right there. Yeah, he's following the little thing. Yeah. He's searching for food. That's cool. He's kind of just circling us. Yep. Yeah, the Super Duty makes a nice uh, traveling cross country airplane. Yeah, it's not the quickest uh, airplane, but it's very stable, very smooth. Um, you can cruise still 100 miles an hour plus, carry what you want, very stable, hands free. You want to try it? Go ahead, put your hand right there. Yep. And we'll just head out here a little ways. Turn to the left. Pull it back just a little bit. There you go. Not too much. There you go. Alright, level out. Okay, lower the nose a little bit. There you go. I got it. So you guys came down and built the rudder a couple months ago, and now you're just waiting on your kit to get the complete kit, start building that, or have you picked up the kit yet? Um, we're buying it in pieces right now. Okay. We have the rudder because we did the rudder workshop, but Correct. we recently just started. We have had the like the tail for a while, okay. but we weren't able to build because we're building it in our garage. We don't have a lot of heat. Okay, yeah. So we had to like install heat, install lights, and we got that done. And like a few days before we got down okay. here, like we started really unpacking, organizing. We oh, good. started building. And it's making sense that uh, once you've unpacked the kit, you recognize the parts and, and get yeah. ready to get started, exactly. Yeah, like the rudder workshop was a big help because like, you guys were all there, and we could pretty much ask anything. Yeah, well, you, you know, we're only a phone call away, too, if you wanted to snag, but um, as you'll find out, it's not that difficult. Yeah, I mean, we didn't really know what we were getting into, and, like, after that, like, we kind of just unpacked it, and we're like, okay, here we go. Yep, like, we just want to exactly start putting it together, you know? Yep. It's pretty much the same process as the rudder, so... It is, it is. Click out the ribbon. So after you build the, the tail section, are you going to try for the wings next or the fuselage? Probably the wings if you're yeah, just doing it in this garage. I think we were going to do the wings, but we haven't really planned that far yet because, okay. you know, like we got other stuff going on. We're right. not going to... You got school for one thing. Yeah, I got school. We have our business to worry about. Right. So it's kind of like, it's not our main focus, but it is up there. Sure. So I think we were going to go for the wings. We'll fly around a few more minutes and then we'll go in for a nice landing. Yeah, nice chilly morning and we all got snow on the ground. You guys have snow up in Wisconsin? Yeah. Yeah. We've had a few warmer days. 
melting, but right now it's about the same as here. Right. At least since I was there. The stall kick for the we're going to do some slow flight. Um, I don't want to pull the power all the way off today just because it's extremely cold. Yeah. I want to keep that engine warm, but we'll do some slow flight here. There's the Bald Eagle again. And where? Below us? Just above us, by the okay. wing. Okay, well, we want to... over there. Oh, I see him. They will head back that way. Keep him in sight. That's probably another one. Yeah. Down. Like I said, I don't want to bring the power all the way back. And we get it in the 50s really easy. Just, uh, we can get it in the 40s. I gotta watch my CHTs, PGTs, and we'll go ahead and add power. Greenville traffic entering 45 for the left downwind for 27. All right, well, we'll go back in and we'll do a stall landing, a short landing. All right. Makes a, a nice off-field landing airplane also with the big Tundra tires. And uh, as you notice when we was airing up the tires, how big the tires are. Yeah. Try to keep an eye out for that eagle. We don't want to get too close. I lost him. I know. Everywhere. Well, we're getting close to the airport. Mexico traffic for almost 750 Super Duty is going to be in our left hand for runway 1A Mexico. Forty-five for a left downwind. Five seven turning final for two seven. Mexico traffic coming for seven two six nine five. We're about uh, ten miles to the southeast, and we're going to be inbound uh, for a taxi bed coming on one eight. Traffic Experiment 750 Super Duty is on the left hand line for 1A Mexico. Alright, beam the numbers. We're going to bring back power a little bit, slow her down. Okay, start losing some altitude. Auto turn a little bit. Mexico traffic, Spermal 750, Super Duty turn left phase, 1A Mexico. Mexico traffic, Spermal turning, final 1A Mexico. Great, 
gonna lower the rest of the flaps. Not much wind today, a lot of lift. Nice, cool, crisp air. Metro traffic, November 72695. We're about four miles to the south, southeast. So we're going to turn left down one for 1A. Did you enjoy your flight today from the 750 Super Duty? Yeah, it's warmer than I expected. Good, yeah. Thanks for traffic number 72695. Someone's behind us, I don't know who it is. Yeah.